The rain wasn't the only thing that drenched the spirits of the Bulldogs fans Friday night, as Safford's sloppy play opened the barn and allowed the Wilcox Cowboys to leave victorious with a 24-6 win. first pass of the night was intercepted, but Wilcox came away empty-handed from the turnover as Safford's defense held its ground. Safford's pass intercepted by number four. It was intended for number 26, Tyler Chisholm. Pass intercepted by Hedges. If not for a few miscues, the Bulldogs might not have taken the 6-0 deficit into halftime. Sanford defense doing a nice job stopping the Cowboys. Offense will take the field. Players gonna look up the middle once again. Looks like fumble on the handoff, and it's gonna be a turnover. Ball recovered by number. Jacob Rage on the 15th. Rigolato under center. He's going to look the pass once again. Pass is intercepted. That's, that's number five. That pass is intercepted by number five. Chris Garobo stepping up. And it looks like it was knocked out of his hands. Third and goal from the two or three. Handoff up the middle. And looks like Cowboys are in for a touchdown. One highlight for Safford was its special teams. The Bulldogs' punting game was spectacular on the night, and twice landed punts a breath away from the goal line. The Cowboys began the second half with a return to its running game and rode senior tailback Anthony Torres to an opening drive score to put them up 12-0. Handoff once again to Torres and he punches it in for the yard out. Touchdown. The score seemed to invigorate the Bulldogs, however, who came back with its finest series of the game and answered behind a touchdown reception by Jalen Higgins. All right, Bulldogs set up in shotgun formation. Look the pass. Pass intended for number seven. And it was caught. Bridge looks at the pass once again. His pass caught by number seven. That is Higgins. Touchdown. The celebration was short lived, however, as the Cowboys returned the ensuing kickoff 95 yards to pay dirt. Wilcox and he is 
He's in for a touchdown. Well, I just thought the kids came off well. The line did a good job blocking. We stayed patient. Um, we stayed with our game plan. I thought we did. Um, and then Torrey just ran well. Uh, we, you know, he made some plays on his own and got outside. And, you know, he, he's a good little back, and I think that's what broke their back is just not keeping him contained. Is that the the game plan? Once you got up by a, a, a large amount, just to, to well, run. Well, you rest know, of we the threw game? the ball a lot the first half, and then we just at halftime we just said, you know what, that's not us. We're gonna come out and and just see if we can't run the ball on them. And, and, you know, that's what the kids asked for at halftime. That, hey, let's just our lineman said we can take care of it, and they and that's what we did. We decided to come out and run. Okay. And I think that right there put it, put it out of reach. You know, it just it's demoralizing when you go down and you finally score. And you're in the, you feel like you're in the game, and all of a sudden, someone takes it back, you know, to the house. And I think that just destroyed them. I, he, I thought that was the turning point of the game right there, because I think up to that point, I thought Safford had the momentum, and, and with with uh, Derek Hedges running that back, I think it just broke their spirit. Wilcox added another score to finish the game 24 to six, but not before the Bulldogs got their licks in. Unfortunately, a tough loss for the Bulldogs, a big win for the Cowboys. Is there anything to be gained from an experience like this? Well, it's, I think the only thing we'll have to pick it up tomorrow to see how, I mean, right now there's nothing, I mean, you could say going back and forth, you know, how we did or we didn't do. I mean, right now, I don't, we didn't play good. I mean, we, you saw how sloppy thing, we didn't play good. And then we go back tomorrow and then we'll go into, uh, we'll see you tomorrow. I want to see how we respond. That's what, when we gain, is how we respond from getting just, I mean, we, we didn't play well, so how we're going to respond and react and come back to it. Next up is Empire. You guys gonna be ready for them? Well, we're. I mean, we're. We better be. I mean, they're. They're, they're coming. They're gonna be a good team. They're gonna come prepared. And they run a, a similar offense to us, so that I know of. And they run a 4-4 defense. So I already kind of. I'm not looked ahead, but I mean, I've seen them in a previous. They played Douglas, so I gotta see them a little bit.